Sky has slapped another pair of customers with a huge fine of £19,000 this week, as the company continued its efforts to combat people illegally broadcasting televised content. Sky Sky Sports TV warning, two men fined £19,000 as crackdown on illegal broadcasts continue not for the first time this year, Sky Sports in fact, the UK's leading intellectual property protection organisation, have clamped down on illegal broadcasting in pubs. Earlier this week two men were ordered by the court to pay over £19,000 after the pair were found guilty of four offences of dishonest reception of a television transmission by showing Sky Sports to customers without a commercial agreement from Sky. Mr. Carl Furlong and Peter Scully of the Park Hotel in Liverpool, Merseyside, were originally found guilty in their absence of four offences and were ordered to pay a combined total of £14,810 in fines and costs on 5 October 2017. Mr. Furlong made a statutory declaration in November 2017 and the case was reopened. He entered a plea of not guilty to all offences but failed to appear at court. The court decided to prove the matter in his absence instead of further adjourning the case and he was fined a total of £18,425. The conviction against Mr Scully obtained in October 2017 still stands which makes the grand total fines and costs for this case £19,671. Who are the hottest boxing ring girls? T-H-E-G-I-R-L-W-H-O-T-A-K-E-S-P-I-C-S The latest development came this week as fact brought the criminal prosecution on Monday 12 February 2017 at Liverpool Magistrates Court against the licensees for showing Sky Sports to customers without having valid commercial viewing agreements in place. Sky Sports is only available to licensed premises in the UK via a commercial viewing agreement from Sky Business. Licensees that show Sky broadcasts without a commercial viewing agreement risk similar action or even a criminal prosecution. Stephen Gerrard, prosecuting manager, fact said, these cases should send a clear warning to pub owners and licensees who show Sky broadcasts without a commercial subscription. If convicted, fines for this offence are unlimited and you may have to pay substantial legal costs, as well as putting yourself at risk of having your license suspended or revoked. Related articles in addition, George Lawson, head of commercial piracy at Sky, also added, It's important to us that businesses are aware of the consequences of showing Sky Sports illegally. It is a serious issue that is damaging to the pub industry, and those licensees who choose to televise content in this way should be aware that they are at high risk of being caught and face substantial penalties. We actively visit thousands of pubs every season to monitor the games they are showing and continue to support FACT's work to protect hard-working Sky customers who are unfairly losing business due to this illegal activity. And as mentioned, this isn't the first or likely last time that members of the public have been fined for televising content illegally. It was only last month that another popular lakeside hotel, restaurant and bar in Brig House, West Yorkshire was also handed a massive fine for illegally showing Sky Sports football matches to its customers without a license. The licensee for the CASA pleaded guilty to six offences of dishonest reception of a television transmission at Kirkley's Magistrates Court. As a result, the establishment was fined £2,500 on each offence, plus ordered to pay a £200 victim surcharge and costs of £9,131.21 making a total over £24,000. Prior to that in July of last year, another pub, Hotel in New Milnes, Scotland was also ordered to pay a £10,000 fine after infringing Sky Sports copyright. Those licensees who choose to televise content illegally should be aware that they are at high risk of being caught and face substantial penalties and a criminal conviction, explained Stephen Gerrard some weeks back. The only legal way to show Sky Sports programming in licensed premises in the UK is via a commercial viewing agreement from Sky. Related articles